everybody. It's Dulce, your Real Hollywood trainer. Yeah. And our workout today is called Crazy Arms. Ooh. That's right. Uh, we're doing an upper body workout. Um, we're going to use our weights. We're going to use our body weight. And then, of course, um, I'm going to add in some cardio elements to bring our heart rate up. Uh, you know how I roll. On the I roll on the locomotion train, that's right. It's crazy arms, crazy arms. So grab your weights, I'm just using five pounds. Uh, we're gonna do some kind of fun stuff, but then uh, we're also gonna do some traditional stuff, but in a split style method. So, I mean, split personality, you know, whatever. Whatever, let's just start with our warm up, right? Let's go. They finally fixed the air in here. I am so happy right now. I can't even tell you. So freaking happy. 20, 19, 17, 14, 12, 10, 9, 7, 4, 3, 2, 1. Alright, now straight go. Nine, eight, five, four, 
Thank you. 
seven, eight, nine, other side, one, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, both arms, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, uh, ten. All right, drop it down.
Ten more seconds. Take it up, keep it in. 
and then reset it. And we'll do the other side, head, shoulder, knee, toe, right here, here, and then on this side, here, here, and on this side. Let's go. Take it up. Touch head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Head, shoulders, knees, toes. Switch that. Head, shoulder, knee, toe. Head, shoulder, knee, toe. Head, shoulder, knee, toe. That's four. Head, shoulder, knee, toe. We're doing ten. Head, shoulder, knee, toe. Loose. Head, shoulder, knee, toe. Head, shoulder, knee, toe. One more on each side. Head, shoulder, knee, toe. Head, shoulder, knee, toe. All right. Stand up. Punch it. Ah. Go. Eight, seven, six, five. Switch. <coughs> Two, switch. Four, eight, seven, six. Switch. Four, three, two, switch. Four, three, two, switch. Three, two, switch. Two, switch. Four, three, two, switch. Last time. Two, switch. Four, three, two, one. All right, our last split exercise. Take your weights. We're gonna do our triceps. Over the head. Just dipping it down to the back. Keep your elbows in. Ten together. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Hold it up. Just the right arm. One. Keep that elbow in. Two. Three. Don't let it go out to the side. Four. Five, six, control it, seven, 
your knees into your chest.
Bring it. <sighs> exactly. Um, again, too, and you know, and or you know, exercise exercise is great too. But like I said, because you know, when you're in the exercise zone, your mind just clears because um, you're focused on what you're doing or the music that you're listening to or whatever. You know, in those times of silence and clarity, sometimes our silence in those times of silence when you're not thinking about it, you can have a moment of clarity. And boom, the answer, the answer or the solution just comes right to you. You know, if you have a difficult problem at work, oh my God, I'm stressing out so much. Then you go and exercise and you're just in your zone and then, oh, why don't I just do that? You know? Um, and, and or like I said, exercise or take a little time to meditate. I know it doesn't have to be sitting there like going, um, with candles on. Um, it could be in the form of a nap. Like, like I, I lay down every afternoon for a little bit, and I'll sleep. I just, you know, sometimes maybe I fall into a little sleep, but I'm just dedicated 30 to 45 minutes with my eyes closed. I promise myself I'm laying on the couch. I'm not opening my eyes for anything for the next 45 minutes. That's my time. My phone is on do not disturb. I am on do not disturb. No one is disturbing me. And you can do that too. I mean, if you can't do it every day, you know, do it on the weekend. Take that moment for yourself. Um, you know, another thing, stay away from alcohol if you're really stressed out, because that is not a solution. And sometimes that just makes things worse. You know, I have friends that get in arguments and when they text, they just say the meanest, nastiest things if they're drunk. Um, and that's not cool, you know? I mean, you could hurt somebody's feelings or, you know, worse off, ruin your relationship or, you know, whatever kind of thing, you know, your job, you don't want to post something on Facebook while you're drunk about whatever, you know? So just watch that alcohol. It can be tricky. Um, and two, another thing that I like to do to, you know, if I'm stressed, just get out of town. Go on vacation for however long it is, even if it's just for a day, taking a day trip down to a new town where you don't know anybody and there's a cute little restaurant or a cute little beach or a cute little mall that you can just walk around in, fill your head with something else. You know, and don't just make it a movie because that's boring. Like I said, you need an adventure to clear your mind and it, can, and it can just be as simple as going three towns over, drive an hour away, you know, take a bus or a train an hour away, just hang out for the day, have some lunch, and then come on back. You know what I mean? The problems are still going to be there, but you're going to be able to ha handle them better um, than you would have if you didn't take that time for yourself. So don't make yourself crazy if things are crazy. Take care of yourself so you can take care of others and you can take care of business, right? You know it. You know it. I told you I'm very, very, very silly today, and it's all right. Woo! Okay. Crazy. Crazy arms. All right, see you later. Bye.